So here is the 1971 Chevy Impala uh, Sport Coupe, I guess. Um, so there's the rear and the back. The exhaust. The bumper. Nice and clean. Decent, decent paint, make paint job done. I can't even remember a few years ago, quite a few years ago. The trunk is all the paint's all jacked up on the trunk, but it's easy to paint that. Take it off and repaint the whole thing. It's got the louvers, the custom louvers in the trunk, lid. There's all the paint marks. The emblem's still there. All the tail lights. Tinted rear window. Real clean top. Side. Spoke rims. I really like them, but you know, whatever. Top. Real clean, clean top. And there's all. Back, all the trim is on the car, all the way around. There's the seats, the ugly cover that's on it. You need to change that, reupholster the seats. The dash is clean, Grant the Grant steering wheel. There's the door panel. All original. The seat, the back seat. Ugly old covers in there. Headliners clean. There. I'll pop open the engine. There's the passenger door panel. Dash mat that's on it. The other rim. Down there's cat prints on the car, stupid cat jumping all over his thing. The front. Good. Windows are nice and clean. There's the engine. Chrome alternator, hunters, and camp for 140 amps. Can't remember. Battery. It's all wired up for a system, but yeah, whatever. You know. Chrome valve covers. 402 Big Block Chevy. Edelbrock Performer intake. Edelbrock carb. Stain and filter. The whole top, everything. Headers. Long tube headers. Dual true dual exhaust all the way out to the back. Flow masters. Chrome tank. Dents, nothing really. Here's the front rim emblem. There. Top. More than here, the passenger door panel. Turn the car off. Oops. Open up the trunk, show you the trunk inside. Clean. Nice clean wires, wiring looks really clean, fairly new. Bags, bunch of bags in here. And there you go. And there's a whole overview of Dino Meta trunk lid. So there you go. It's a 1971 Impala. All original, 101,000 original miles.